Wenchi joins. Hello everybody, it's uh, Noah here from Wanchain, and uh, this is a short video that I'm putting together to let all of you know how to use the newest DAP Store feature, which was added to the Desktop Light Wallet. So to get started, make sure you've downloaded and installed the Desktop Light Wallet from onechain.org slash get started. Uh, so to get there, just go to onechain.org and click on the get started tab and scroll down and download the Desktop Light Wallet for your system. Uh, make sure you don't download any of the other wallets since they don't have they don't currently have support for the DAP store. Once you've downloaded your wallet, uh, if you need help with the installation, check out explorewanchain.org and click on the one wallet tab underneath wallet and tools here on the left for a complete explanation of how to install and set up your wallet. Now, uh, once you've got your wallet installed and set up and you've got a little bit of one in your one wallet account uh, open up the wallet and you'll see here on the left side underneath galaxy proof of stake there is a newly added tab dap store let's click on that let's click on more dapps to add new dapps and now while currently there's only one dap that has been added to the store in the future you'll be able to search amongst multiple different dapps by name through this search bar here. So let's add one door box by clicking the add button here. And you should get a notification that it was added su successfully. And then you'll see here on the left, underneath the DAP store tab, one door box was just added to your wallet. So let's click on that. And uh, one other thing to note is that uh, while this video is about how to access one door box through the light wallet, it's also available through the web interface at wondora.finexus.app. And there's really only one difference between these two different ways to access the DAP, and that is that uh, on the web interface, you can use uh, the OneMask extension wallet, Ledger or Trezor, and through the desktop light wallet version, you can use the addresses that you have the, the one accounts that you have already in your, your desktop light wallet. Okay, so we're going to uh, go with the desktop version here. And uh, if you haven't seen the game before, uh, it might look a little bit complex, but it's actually very simple. Uh, all you're doing is making a prediction about whether or not the price at the end of the time period will be higher or lower than the starting price, which is listed up here. Uh, so the, the total time period is eight hours long and we see the countdown to the end of it right here So the time period ends five hours and 54 minutes later and You're making a prediction whether or not the price will be higher or lower than 0 0.00001978 BTC to 1 and So to make your prediction you simply click up if you predict the price will be higher and down if you predict that the price will be lower also, please note down here, there's this note which says buying in this round will be closed in three hours and 54 minutes. So you can see there's, there's a two hour buffer period between when the last prediction can be placed and the final price, which is used for comparing. Uh, so this is to prevent any last minute uh, uh, predictions that somebody makes uh, since uh, that's, you know, that the game wouldn't be so fun if everyone waits to the very last minute to place their bets. So, uh, and let's say I make a predict, a pre let's say I make a correct prediction on up, uh, and you can see here, 69% of, of uh, predictions are on up, 30.8% of them are on down. So if I'm correct, then that 30.8% of, of uh, uh, one from the down predictions will be distributed amongst everyone who made an up prediction. Uh, and it will be distributed uh, proportionally to how much you placed on your prediction. All uh, right, so let's see. I think I'm going to place an up prediction. And let's see, I'll just do one one to get started. And yes.
And yeah, and that's it. Now I'm done. So uh, to check if I win, I just come back after the end of this time period. And then I can look down here in the trend history uh, to see which side won, up or down. And then if I win, my rewards will be automatically sent back to me. Uh, and hopefully I don't lose, but if I lose, then the uh, amount that I placed on my prediction will be distributed amongst the winners. So another kind of cool little feature is the prize pot. So if you look here off to the right, where it says 36.41, that's a prize pot. So what this means is every time anyone places a bet, either up or down, uh, some part of the bet will be added to the prize pot. And everybody uh, who, bet, who makes a prediction, whether they make a correct one or whether they don't, they get a chance to win this prize pot. So that's a cool, nice little uh, extra fun feature that uh, you know, it means every time you play, you can still have a chance to win. Uh, yeah, and so that's pretty much the game. Uh, and in the future, hopefully there will be some more price pairs added so that you can make predictions on other pairs like uh, BTC to USDT or uh, Wan to USDT or um, you know, any, any other of uh, many potential pair, uh, price, uh, uh, pairs that, that could be predicted on. Uh, yeah, and so if you have any other questions, please do reach out to us on our social media. The best way is probably to get in contact with an admin at our official Telegram chat. You can also reach out to us on Twitter or any of our other social media platforms. So thanks very much for watching, guys, and uh, till next time. We are waiting. Join us.